What's up guys, my name is Hugh Miller and today is a day that I had personally hoped would never really show up but was kind of inevitable at the same time. Today, Little Jackalope of the Amateur Sleuth Blog of Her Interactive announced that she will be leaving Her Interactive after 10 years, over 10 years of working there. Um, I'm just going to read through what her uh, blog post was that she posted today. So the title is 10 Years of Amateur Sleuthing. Dear Amateur Sleuths and Master Sleuths, this month marks my anniversary of being a full-time team member of Her Interactive Incorporated. Some of you know my story. After college, I became a game production intern in June 2010. In November, the marketing intern, and in June 2011, the marketing coordinator, joining the team full-time. Wow, 10 years. Well, longer than that, really, because of my internships. Let's take a quick look down memory lane and reflection of the past decade. 10 years is a lot to summarize, but I must mention some of my cherished memories in no particular order. Number one. Doodling pictures for the Amateur Sleuth blog posts. Number two, sharing behind the scenes teases from our office. Number three, interviewing fellow team members. Well, as creative director, I, um, my responsibility is to ensure that all the elements of the game, uh, from the story to the gameplay, uh, puzzles, art, music, Characters, everything that all the little elements that come together, uh, they come together in a cohesive way that makes a very fun game play experience for the player. And Number four, tasting and promoting a real life Cocoa Kringle chocolate bar. Little Jackalope of the Amateur Sleuth Blog. Guess what? The Cocoa Kringles are back! Number five, visiting new food trucks with the team. Number six, playing hacky sack in the afternoons for a little exercise. Let's see, I wonder which one Little Jackalope is. <laughs> Number seven, trying to figure out who was leaving mysterious Easter eggs in my office desk. Number eight, 101 Twitch parties with all our greatest Nancy Drew friends. Cheeseburger. Cheeseburger. <laughs> the thing is, the owner of the diner wouldn't agree to point the guy out. Number nine, voicing a minor character, the cookie lady, in the silent spy. Oh. Hello. You want to make some money? Then make some cookies. The cookie order shows up down there. Make it exactly as shown if you want to get paid. The more cookies you make, the wealthier you get. Number 10. Voicing the giggly girl talking to Ned in Midnight in Salem. Secretly Ned's new girlfriend, LOL. <laughs> Ned, come on! Call you later, Nancy. Number 11. Getting my sixth grade picture into Alibi and Ashes. Number 12, making vlogs and fun videos for YouTube. Thanks again for agreeing to come out. I'm sure this ghost bridge business is all nonsense, but I'd like someone more qualified to check it out. Number 13, working alongside seven terrific interns. Hi, I am the new marketing intern for Her Interactive this summer. You can call me Phoenix, I'm going to go by that as my nickname, so feel free to ask a question and say, hey Phoenix, blah blah blah. Hey guys, I'm Dahlia, and welcome to the very first summer internship vlog. Hey Nancy Drew fans, it's summer and you know what that means, new summer intern. Hi, I'm Ellie, the new Her Interactive summer intern. Hi guys, my name's Indy, and I'm the new summer intern. I'm from Indiana where I go to Butler University and there I study digital media production and art plus design. Hello everyone, my name is Tess and I will be joining in at Her Interactive as the second marketing intern. Surprise! Hello everybody, Little Jack Lobe of the Amateur Sleuth blog here today with Tess and Jai and she is our new intern today. Yay. Well, not just for today. <laughs> <laughs> intern of the day. <laughs> intern of the day. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, we have a new member here, and her name is Cece. Hi! <laughs> <laughs> Number 14. Writing over 300 weekend puzzles, codes, ciphers, riddles, etc. Number 15. Getting to be involved with game walkthroughs and puzzle testing before we reach beta. Number 16. Visiting the recording studio, feeding actors their lines, and getting to meet the voice of Bess Marvin, Frank and Joe Hardy, and one of the actresses for George Fane. Number 17. Making and sharing official game trailers and reveling in everyone's excitement. 
Number 18. Also, launching 11 new games and getting people just as excited about it as I got. This is my favorite part. You will get the bonus mission. Here's to another decade of Nancy Drew games and her interactive Nancy Drew community. What's around the corner, you might ask? Well, more Nancy Drew games, of course. New merchandise and exciting things are indeed ahead. My dear friends, amateur and master sleuths alike, a new adventure awaits me in my career. That's right, I never imagined this day would come. However, I will not be leaving the Nancy Drew community. You'll see me around. I will be a Her Interactive Advisor on future games, and hey, maybe even guest posts on the Amateur Sleuth blog again. Nonetheless, Her Interactive and I have a future ahead, just in different offices. It's hard to say goodbye, but I'm not really leaving. I just won't be an official team member anymore. Change is hard, and this is quite bittersweet for me. No worries though, there are some great team members at Her Interactive who are working hard behind the scenes. I can't say much, but be sure to subscribe to the official newsletter to stay up to date on all the exciting things to come, or follow Her Interactive slash Nancy Drew Games on social media. I do hope to stay in touch with you with all of my personal accounts and channels. Follow me, Kalina Herman, of at story underscore retold on social media or check out my website www.kalinaherman.com If you see the little cartoon red panda on social media, you'll know that's me. You'll especially know it's me because my real face is around as well as a ton of Nancy Drew stuff, haha. <laughs> what can I say? I'm a super Nancy Drew nerd. And now, I leave you with this Nancy Drew blessing. May your doors always be unlocked and stay sleuthy. Signed, Kalina, Little Jackalope, Joyce Herman. Not gonna lie, I was I was pretty stunned. I was saddened. I was very I, I was just sad when I read Little Jackalope's announcement on her uh, her Instagram. I was it was just disheartening. I was like, oh man, like it, it's literally an end of an era. Like she was such a huge part of her interactive's community, uh, the company, and just how how we as fans got information and sort of saw what the company was like back in twenty. 12 to 2014 I guess she produced some incredible videos that really just showed off what the company was all about who they were and why it was just a great place to work and I just that was as you know as a younger kid back then I just loved that and I still look back on those videos now and just think man I miss those days I really do um, I never thought this day would come I don't know why. I mean, obviously, no one can work at a company forever, and a company can't last forever. But I, I, I don't know. I just never really, I never thought the day that we would see little Jackalope leaving the company. I just never thought that would happen, and yet here we are. Uh, so it, it is sad. It is very sad. But I, I interviewed her back in 2016 um, for my YouTube channel, and it was just brilliant to have a chat with her because she is so kind, so chill so enthusiastic um i know i just said chill but you know you know what i'm talking about she's down to earth uh she loves uh her job loves nancy drew it's it was just incredible to have a chat with her uh and because of that and because of what i've seen in videos and just you know in general on in, on the internet uh she has a bright future and uh yeah i i, I only i can only wish her the best and the best of luck and I I can't see why anything could go poorly for her because she's such a just a brilliant person uh, and I seriously cannot say I've thanked her so many times for things she's done for me uh, and for my channel but I, I genuinely cannot thank her enough because she has seriously helped me out so much with uh, little bits of information or bits, little graphics and whatnot that I've used in videos and it's just been it's just been huge, and um, obviously all those stories are still with her. It's not like she's leaving the stories behind. You can't really extract... It's not Harry Potter. You can't extract memories and just get rid of them. Um, but yeah, it is just... It's just it's just sad is what it is. Uh, but again, she's got a bright future. She's going to do so well at... I don't know where she's working next. Um, but wherever it is, she's going to do great. It's going to be awesome. And uh, I can't wait to follow her adventure. So Kalina, thank you so much. Thank you. And I, I think I, I speak for a ton of fans when I say you have done so much for us, for the company. It's been great. And the best things in life don't last forever. And this is one of those things. So thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you.